Guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna to be filming my second Q and A. Put a post up on Instagram uh, last night. Yep. I just asked people to ask me some questions because I had nothing else to film. So yeah. Starting off with a uh, Jack Murray underscore one two three four. Who's your favorite scooter rider, and what will be your goal for twenty eighteen? And I think, uh, yeah, it's a different question. Alright. So my favorite rider, I've changed my mind. Is now Bart Ostrova. If you don't know who that is, then you're missing out. He's an he's such a techie rider, and I'd say my sub goal for 2018 will probably be 600. Just double my goal for 2017, and I've nearly reached that now. Dylan underscore O'Connor 16. Who was the most techie rider you know? And I'm not saying the second part of that question, Dylan. But yeah, uh, the, tech, the most techie rider you know is Dylan. If you don't know who he is, I'll link one of his old edits down below. Um, used to ride with him a lot, but yeah, uh, unfortunately he quit. Dylan, get back up on it. Like the video if you want to see uh, Dylan O'Connor come back at it. Alright. Uh, Muhammad underscore CHR, what's the crack? Nothing much, man, yourself. Adam Byrne with three E's. What trick do you want to learn next? I'd have to say 360 whip downside finger whip. Or 360 double downside finger whip. Because I like doing downside finger whips and I like doing them like in a 360 spin because they look better. Owen Doyle, what's your favorite trick? Um, downside finger whips. I just have to say, any downside trick really. D Machu DD, when are you gonna flip? Uh, a lot of people would have seen the clip of me failing a front flip. Um, I can't find the clip. I went looking for it earlier, but um, I tried a front flip over the Radskate Resi. I uh, didn't rotate enough, landed straight on my back. The next time I went for it, I uh, threw my foot down too, too early to do a fast land and just went straight over the bars. So that's kind of scary from front flips and back flips, just I don't like them. Jordan Dot McDonald, favourite BMXer from Waterford and a little winky face. Probably Jordan McDonald actually. Yeah, probably you because um, if you don't know who Jordan McDonald is, Instagram down below, he's absolutely amazing BMX rider from Waterford. Uh, but yeah, make sure you follow him. NBSMX underscore. What's your dream sponsor? Ooh, dream sponsor. If these sponsorships don't really like, they don't. You don't have to be sponsored to be, or you don't have to be good at scootering. What am I trying to say? Having a sponsor doesn't prove that you're good at scootering, because, like, you can be good, but you can be unsponsored. I mean, think of people like Leo Spencer. He left Sacrifice, but, and he's had offers from companies, but he doesn't want to take it because he doesn't want to be sponsored. But I don't know; it's a hard question because I don't know if I want to be sponsored or, or by anyone. But yeah, I'd say if I had to be sponsored by one company, it'd be um, MGP because their parts are so light. All right, Jake Gray official. How do you learn bigger tricks fast, and how do you grow on YouTube? Shout out, please, and your channel is really good. Shout out to Jake Gray official. So how do you learn a, big, a bigger trick fast? You can't just like skip straight towards bigger tricks. Like a lot of people, when I teach camps and reckless or teach private lessons, say, "Oh, I want a bright flip," but they can't tail it. Like you have to go up in order of like the easiest trick to the hardest trick. Like I didn't. Well, in saying that, I used to go straight for finger whips before I could tail it, but got pretty close. But yeah, you gotta learn the, the basics first, and then you move on to like the more advanced stuff. And then, how do you grow on YouTube? Uh, get yourself a, a schedule and try and stick to it as best you can. Like I have Tuesday and Sunday. Sometimes I miss a day, but yeah, that's the reason I'm filming this video because I had nothing else planned for today. So yeah, that's pretty much how you grow. Uh, Muhammad underscore chor also asked, how long does it usually take you to learn a trick? There's two things that always like contribute to me learning a trick. If I'm riding with someone that I like, or like if I'm having a session with people that I get along with, or um, if I really want to do it, like, when I went down to Waterford, I learned, I think it was 13 new tricks in one day, just because I was riding with other scooter riders, which, up here, I don't really get the chance to, because not too many people scooter anymore up here, 
But yeah, um, it really depends. But sometimes it'll take me like an hour if I really put my mind to it. Depending on the trick though. Uh, CXLUM.Vic Will we be seeing daily uploads in 2017? <sighs> I could barely keep up seven... I could barely put up fucking seven videos in Spain. Put up three, so... I don't know. Maybe in the summer I'll try it for a while. But yeah. Uh, Alex... KB04 What was your first scooter? My first scooter was... An MGP VX1 that I bought off my friend for 60 euro with some MGP Mad Hatter bars. If you don't know what they are, the little uh, VX2 Team Edition bars. This is back in the day before they had integrated headsets. So you didn't just like put your headset into your um, deck. You have to have these cups. And if you remember headset cups, then you know the struggle of trying to like put your headset together. And it was a, a threaded headset as well, so it was never tightened. But yeah, it done the job until like a year later. But yeah, still... Uh, Kieran J37, what's your sub goal for the end of the year? I'd like to be on 400 by the end of the year because if I get to 300 soon, then another six months I could probably get up another 100. But yeah, probably 400. Uh, Ben.S7, Dream Skate Park. <coughs> Sorry. So, Ben, I think if you mean like Dream Skate Park to travel to, it would probably be Corby in. England, because Corby just looks like a mad skate park. All right, Reese underscore Beast one two three. Would you rather be able to whip front skew flat or buttercup flat? Hmm, I'd say whip front skew because a whip front skew just like you flick it around, so it seems like it looks cooler. I think like a buttercup looks cool, but like a whip front skew is just like one hand, just one hand thing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna stop doing it. But yeah, whip front skew. Underscore Kyle dot Bailey underscore what's your dream trick? Bry Mac. I really want to learn Bry Max. And I'll tell you what, 50 likes and I will learn Bry Max soon. So yeah, 50 likes. Alright, Georgina one Mac, what would you do other than scootering? Probably get a job, which is something else I need to do. But yeah, I don't know, because I've been scootering so long now it just feels like different to do anything else. Like a lot of people say to me, like, oh, you should ride BMX or ride skateboards, not scooters, but the thing is, I enjoy riding scooters, so yeah. So that is the end of this Q and A. Hope you all enjoyed. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram if you want to take part in the next Q and A. I'll put it like down in the description, as well as my Snapchat. I'll be on Snapchat because I'll be doing a Snapchat Q and A really soon. Uh, but yeah, hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Alright guys, first of all I just want to say I'm sorry about the quality in this video, I'm recording on my iPad and the quality isn't really the best, but yeah, um, I've had this video recorded for quite a while now, I just never got around to uploading it, that's why I'm uploading it now, I'm sorry about it being so late, I mean, this will be up about <coughs> 20 to 9, um, uh, so yeah, I'm sorry that it's up so late, I was meant to record a different video today but I just never got around to it, uh, there's a comp in an article on Friday, I'll definitely be recording a video there, I might make an edit out of all the runs and everything, it's not just for scooters, it's BMX, rollerblading, skateboarding, so yeah, I'll be getting clips there, definitely, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, um, also, add my Snapchat, I'll put, I'll put it somewhere on the screen, because I'll be having something up about a possible giveaway, uh, to do with my Snapchat and my YouTube soon, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, like the video if you, if you enjoyed it, comment down below what you want to see next, subscribe if you're new, click the little bell so you know when I upload, and yeah, I'll see you in the next video.